Well, howdy folks, how y'all is? Today we're gonna be trying this here. I picked this up that day we left Tabasco and they wouldn't take any cash. I went over to Avery Island, or uh, not Avery Island, that's where Tabasco is, but Jefferson Island to the uh, Rip Van Winkle Gardens. They had a little gift shop there and I bought this Fried Dad special blend. Look at that special blend. Family recipe since 1985 season. All-purpose fry mix, fish, shrimp, chicken, pork, beef, venison, vegetables. See back of box for directions. It should say prescription. Anyways, blended and packed for Bayou Dad, LLC. They're in Opelousas. And uh, there's the ingredients. If you want to read through all that shit, I don't feel like it. Anyway, it says here for the directions, the prescription on the back of the box. Family hard at work great food and uh it says here cooking uh, prescription says uh prepare wet prep by mixing four eggs one cup milk one cup yellow mustard and some hot sauces taste uh dip the items in a wet wet drip place in the pan uh, i think we're gonna do this a little differently so that's what it looked like coming out of the package there it's cornmeal seasoned cornmeal cornflour is what it looks like and i got me a big ass bag of shrimps i mean that's a lot of shrimps there's probably 60 70 shrimps in there we're gonna fry up so what i done did is i took uh about half that bag of shrimps because that's just too damn many shrimps i put them off in here because i mean i can only eat so much shrimp at one time even though i love shrimp i mean uh, i can only eat so much so we're gonna do something else with some other shrimps maybe tonight. Maybe we make shrimp and grits or something. But today, for lunch, we're gonna have some fried shrimps using that product there, fried that. So, I'm gonna open the bag up, coat these up good. Over here, got my grease going, so that's gonna be on. Ooh, I can smell the seasoning in that. So it's free seasoning and all. And I'm just gonna go ahead and toss this in the fry that seasoning flour here and fry these it's gonna be a lot lighter than if you would actually use the wet dip it makes a bigger crust but i don't really want that bigger crust i, I like it kind of lighter and I'm not quite as crusty on these and i'll probably get some toss these in some hot sauce and butter and do them hot sauce style anyway but all right here we go here's the shrimps let's drop them in the skillet there Oh, I made a quick little batch here. I just want to try the season and see if I like it and if I need to add anything to it quick. So let's uh, try one of these out. So that's pretty tasty as it is, but I think I might add a little Tony's to it and give it a little spice. So the batter's pretty good, but for my taste, I'm adding a little Tony Sashes to it because I like it things kicked up and nice, it's a little more spicy. There we go. Now that's looking the way I like it right there. So for my personal taste, I still think that nothing competes with the Louisiana fish fry in your own style, straight out of the package. You don't have to add anything to it, it's just absolutely delicious. Ooh wee folks, look at that there, fried shrimp, don't that look delicious? I know you're going to be delicious. So I'm going to do these shrimps here, kind of buffalo style, with the hot sauce, and in the hot sauce I have Tabasco garlic hot sauce, and Mexican Valentina hot sauce. I love that stuff too. And some butter. And to kick it up even a little more, we got some extra spice. Tony's, nothing but spice. Has less sodium. Now this here is gonna puck in my lips today and puck in my butthole tomorrow. Now let's drizzle this flaming hot jizzle all over this shrimps. Mmm, it's gonna be delicious, folks. Now I made a little homemade ranch here to kind of cool my mouth off and I'm going to throw a little green onion on here to finish it off and tomorrow we'll get some tucks for the backside. Mmm, this is fantastic folks. Well, thanks for watching this episode. I hope this product review helps you get you some fried at and try it out if you see it when you're making grocery in your neck of the woods. Alright folks, thanks for watching. 
peace, love, and all that other good stuff. We'll see you folks right here again for another fantastic review.